Setting a goal is like creating an art. It all takes passion, determination, and motivation to pursue the masterpiece that you want to achieve. And that is by believing that you yourself can do it. Hi there! If you don't have any idea of what you want to do or what you want to succeed at yet, don't worry. I've got you covered. If you sat there thinking that there's been a lot of changes that you want to make and you've never been able to motivate yourself to do it, now is the time to take a piece of paper or simply your phone or laptop and jot down all the things that you want to pursue may be on short or long term. Now turning these ideas into goals is very simple. All you have to take is the SMART method. My 16 year old self will reveal to you this art of goal setting. In creating your goal worksheet, the very first thing that you will determine are the dates. The date that you've written it, the date that you started the goal, the target date, and the date that you've achieved the goal. Afterwards, you need to identify a specific goal that you want to accomplish, maybe on long term and short term. And my 16 year old self dream is to accomplish my studies and finally to become a medical professional and guess what goal update it is still my biggest goal right now and then you need to verify whether your goal is smart smart stands for specific measurable achievable relevant and timely specific you need to ask yourself what you want to accomplish and most importantly why make it measurable are you able to tell when you reach your goal Achievable. That goal should stretch you so you feel excited but within your current ability. But that your goal should not be too impossible for you to reach. Relevant. Set goals that are going to positively impact your life. Does this goal fit in with your other life's goals and dreams? Timely. A goal with time deadline will create a sense of urgency and give you the energy you need to complete it. Yet your timeline should never be based on others. Just take your own pace, but always remember to keep track with the target time. You also need to know the importance of your goal and what can it impact and benefit in your life. Now it's time to take into the action plan. First, you need to identify the possible obstacles. If there will be hindrances along the way, it's important to determine them ahead and plan out the potential solutions. We cannot always control all the things, but one way or another, we can manage them when we have plans. Also, because we are not an island in this journey, we need to identify the people who will be with us along the process. And lastly, the specific action steps. When you have a long-term goal like mine, you need to break it down into smaller steps in order to build them into your larger or ultimate goal. It will help you understand what specific things you would do to reach your goal. It is somewhat a roadmap in how to get there. So goal update. I have already completed two destinations, finishing junior and senior high school. It would be a long way to go, but hopefully in this grace, I will fulfill what I had written in this paper. Life is not about finding yourself. It's about creating yourself. And in that process, we always want success. But what truly measures success is not those receive recognitions like certificates, trophies, or medals, but it is how you become significant to your family and to your community when you have reached your goal. To be successful is to be significant.